it's a messy cook here. Happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. Today we're going to show you some uh, steaks on the Blackstone. And this is a great Father's Day uh, dinner. So here we go. I've got some uh, certified Angus beef petite sirloin here. Uh, I've let them rest for about 30 minutes outside of the refrigerator. And I'm just going to pat them dry because you don't want any of that extra moisture on there because they will steam when you put them on the Blackstone. So we're going to do that. We're going to put on some bourbon barrel steak seasoning that I have. Uh, compliments of the messy mom. Thank you. And uh, we're gonna get going. Now to prepare our steaks, I've got my padded dry steaks. I'm just gonna put a little bit of oil on the top because that's gonna help them sear. Rub that on there. Then we're gonna take our spice and we're just gonna sprinkle that on top. And we're gonna do that on each side. We wanna get a little bit of oil on there. Helps them get a nice crusty sear. Okay, we've got our blackstone nice and heated up. You want this thing to be piping hot so you can sear those steaks straight away. So we're gonna put a little bit of oil on there and make sure it's nice and spread around. We're gonna take our seasoned oiled steaks. Should hear that nice sizzle. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Now we're gonna actually flip these often because we want that sear to build up. And I've got also some melted butter here that we're going to baste with. You can see the potatoes cooking on that side. So we've got a nice four burner going here. And we're going to get a nice sear on those and get those cooking. So, Okay, we've got about a minute gone so far now here. Let's check our... Oh, look at that. We've got a beautiful sear on that. Going to flip it over. Sear it on the other side. Now we're going to take some butter, our melted butter. Baste a little bit. Help that get that, continue that sear going. We're gonna do that each time we flip it. So about a minute on each side, keep flipping it, then we're gonna get our steaks. Side note for our potatoes, I've just got sliced potatoes, sliced real thin, about an eighth inch thick, and some onions. Season them up, put some oil on the griddle, put them on there and just fry them up. Okay, we're down to minute two. We're gonna flip those again. I've got one steak that's kind of odd shaped, so I'm gonna put that on its side and make sure that that side gets uh, it's uh, seared as well. Again, we flip some more butter, basting, and it helps get this, keep the sear going. And then we've also got our kin, uh, kitchen uh, meat thermometer. We're gonna check that in the side of the steaks here when we're when we're getting ready to get done, see how we're doing. Now I can see here, I've actually got the steaks on their side because you wanna get the sides of the steak seared. You wanna do the fat side first so you get that rendered off and get some of that fat uh, or fat. The oil's going there so you can cook the steak further. And then do the other side, and then we're gonna check the temperature and be good to go. Our steak's just about done here. We're gonna check our temperature. So our meat thermometer, just about 140, so that's about medium rare. The medium. Oh, perfect. We're gonna take those off now. See, they got the nice sear on them. We're gonna let them rest a few minutes. We're gonna finish up our potatoes here which are looking nice and crisp with the onions get those going there and dinner will be served just a quick tip when you're done with the blackstone and the cooking i turn my heat off i let it sit for about five minutes give it a squirt of oil or i'm sorry water a water bottle and scrape it look at that it comes right right on right clean scrape it into that Reservoir in the back there. Give it another shot of water. It literally is clean and ready, ready to go. Just give it a shot of oil after it cools completely down, and you're ready to go for the next time. Come on, come on, come on, over here. Sit. Look up. Okay, we've got our nice blackstone seared steaks. I'm gonna call the family down, but I'm gonna try it first before we before we go. Oh, cooked perfectly, medium, medium temperature, and well. As always, excellent.